Subterranean termites form colonies in soil, which provides moisture and protection from extreme temperatures, making them more widespread than drywood termites, which live directly in the wood they consume. Since their colony size isn't limited by wood, a single subterranean termite colony can cause more structural damage than a drywood termite colony. Although subterranean termites occur in every state except Alaska, structural infestations are more common in warmer climates. Frozen topsoil limits subterranean termites in areas with extremely cold winters, reducing the overall number of structural infestations in these regions. While most structure-infesting subterranean termites in North America are native species, the Formosan subterranean termite is an introduced species native to southern China. It is the most widely distributed and economically damaging subterranean termite in the world, though its distribution in the United States is mostly limited to southeastern states and Hawaii. Formosan subterranean termites can cause more structural damage in less time due to their high reproductive capacity, which produces colonies 10 times the size of native subterranean termites. Trelona ATBS annual bait stations simplify termite management with just one inspection a year, and the bait cartridges stay effective for at least five years, reducing long-term costs. Termidor foam targets termites inside the structure, working like above-ground bait stations. By combining effective baiting and direct treatment, these products provide a comprehensive solution for protecting structures from subterranean termite damage. Visit Viserys.com for more information. And be sure to take our Pro Training Online course, Subterranean Termites and Building Foundations. Like and subscribe to be notified when new videos are posted.